I, I've been pushing that myself, just telling people that if you become a specialist in generative AI in your industry, then you're going to be worth a lot more. And I know you know this, Patrick, that the more you use this, the more efficient you become. So it does make sense that if somebody's very good at this technology, and we are still early, so there's there's still m more people who are not using it than are using it. So if you can become a specialist in your field using this technology, making yourself far more efficient, making yourself far more valuable, then you're gonna be worth more. I mean, it's as simple as that. The 28% premium is pretty significant, I'm excited to hear that. I believe it's going to continue to grow. I don't know if you know what are some of any other any other information from that that you Yeah. 66% growth rate in human resources just alone. Oh, and that's man. that's astonishing. You said in HR and human resources. Yes, in HR. Wow. Yeah, you know what? That's interesting. Um that's well above that 28% average. It does make sense. So, think about it. I think I think the part of the reason why is because this generative AI essentially can replace a lot of what HR does. You know, a lot of the 